Hey guys, it's Rob from Ghetto Outdoors in Balcata, your number one WA family owned camping store. Um, all right, I'm gonna discuss vacuum sealed camping meals. So most people, when they think uh, vacuum sealer, the first thing that comes to mind is stuff like, you know, meats like, whether it's fish, uh, this is chicken, steaks, etc. Uh, the reason you vacuum seal is to get all the air out of the, um, the container or, or bag, so it lasts a lot longer in the fridge or the freezer stops freezer burn. Um, and obviously that's why when you buy some meat that's been vacuum sealed, the expiry date or the best before is always weeks uh, longer than if you buy it in a Tupperware container or the, the ones with more air in it. Okay, um, here you can see I've got some pre-made vacuum sealed meals that I've taken out the freezer. This is a Thai red chicken curry. I've got a spaghetti bolognese and one of our secret family recipes, spaghetti and beans, which is like bacon hocks with pasta and red beans. Okay, so um, I'm gonna go through and show you what I, what I do. Oh, the reason I do them, by the way, is because if you look at the size of this, the idea is I push them flat, you get a lot more in your esky or cooler. Rather than a standard Tupperware container, which is a lot more bulky, um, takes up a lot more room. You can actually slot these down the sides of an esky or a freezer on top. Um, they're much easier to work with. Even at home, not even just camping, you'll get a lot more of these stacked up in your freezer than you would with odd shaped Tupperware containers. Okay, so now I'm gonna show you um, how to do it. One trick I do when I'm vacuum sealing, uh, when, once you've got your vacuum sealer bag, depending on the size you want and how many people, is I actually roll back the edges. This stops the moisture getting on, on the edges, making it a little bit harder to seal. So I'll roll that back. Alrighty, so once I've uh, done that, I'm gonna, this is uh, another little trick is if you um, put your meal in the fridge overnight, it will um, take a bit of the moisture, making it a little bit easier to, to vacuum seal as well. You don't have to, you can do it fresh. Uh, especially if you've got a good vacuum seal, I like this pack food VS603. These are our top of the range vacuum sealer we sell in store. Okay, so once you've got that in, we're gonna fold back the edges nice, nice and flat. We're gonna flatten the meal to the, you know, the desired size. I like them sort of an inch and a half or so high. Okay, that'll do. I'm gonna put the end into this area here, into where the ceiling happens. There we go. Okay, now, this, this pack food one, you can actually adjust the seal time. Three is about standard, that does most things. If you do have uh, stuff that's got a bit more moisture, like you do catch a fish and you're filleting it straight away, you can up that to four, but three is a good all-rounder. I'm gonna leave it at three because I've had this in the fridge overnight. You can also seal this one on the hand, like on the handle here, it's got a, the button to, to seal it, or on the unit itself. So it's just nice and easy to use. So, Okay, so I'm gonna start. So we count down to nine and it's automatically gonna stop once it sucks the air out. So if it's before nine, it'll automatically cut off, or if it needs longer, it'll also do that too. Now it's doing the seal, counting down from three. And there we go, sounds like an airplane door opening, that means it's all done. And you can see that's sucked out all the air, and that's a beautiful, nutritious meal, ready when you're camping. There's nothing better when you're camping, uh, under the stars, you know, having a beautiful home-cooked meal, that is effortless to cook. You literally can put that in a pot of boiling water, or we just put it in a little pot, heat it up, absolutely delicious. Okay, we've also, packed foods have a range of different vacuum sealed bags, which we carry in store and online. You can see all the different sizes we carry, they do bags, these are all pre-cut. I use, for my meal, a 250 by 350, um, and that's a great meal for the wife, me, the wife, and our little son, Rex. Uh, obviously, when he gets a little bit older and starts eating a little bit more, we'll, uh, we can put a bit more, we'll, we could actually get more in that bag anyway, so. But yeah, we do the whole range, guys. Um, come see us at Get Her Outdoors in Balcata. Uh, read the link as well. If there's anything you need to know about what we've talked about today, pop in the store, have a read, or jump on our website. Thank you very much.